There's a rescue effort underway at this hour, and a young life is on the line. Rescuers are trying to dig into a small cave near the town of Heber, and inside is a family pet, a champion hunting dog to be exact. Rod Decker just returned from Heber, and what's the update, Rod? Michelle, the dog's named Rebel, and he is a champion at hunting raccoons. About 44 hours ago, he chased a raccoon into a cave and got stuck. Digger here is the son of Rebel and looks a lot like him. 16-year-old Stephanie Giles loves Rebel and wants him to be rescued. He's the best dog that we've ever had. He barks at you when you come out. He has a little, like, like a little hello bark, and we just got to get him out. We can't, we can't leave him in there. Rebel chased a raccoon into this cave, and Stephen Giles put Dogger here at the opening to bark, trying to lure Rebel out. That didn't work. Rebel is wearing a special locator collar, and his owner, Stephen Giles, can use an electronic tracker to tell where Rebel is trapped underground, and he can tell Rebel is alive and moving. He's right here. He's pegging my needle. Steve Giles and his friends drained the water over the cave, then they got a backhoe to dig where the electronic locator showed Rebel was trapped. The backhoe hit impermeable lava rock, and Steve Giles and his friends used jackhammers, drills, a big iron bar, and a diamond tooth rock saw to try to cut down to Rebel. Even with all the equipment, progress is painfully slow. As you can see, the lava rock broke a tooth off the backhoe. They had to stop and weld another tooth back on. The men worked through the dust and kept hope to free Rebel. What's going to happen if you get him out? He's going to sleep in my bed tonight. He's going to eat dinner with me at the table. <laughs> well, Rebel isn't out yet. They're still at the scene. They're still working. Probably be there all night. They've sent for some heavier drill equipment. They hope to get Rebel out sometime tomorrow. Been two days already, so it's been a while. And this is all a family affair? Uh, this is a family affair and friends. These are amateurs up there, and they're just working and getting equipment and improvising and trying to save their dog. Right. Doing the best they can. We'll see what happens. Yeah, no. well, a dog given up for dead was rescued this afternoon from a cave in Midway, Utah. Rebel is a champion raccoon hunter. Yeah, and he chased a raccoon into a cave, and as Rod Decker shows us, it took very persistent owners and friends to finally get him out. Okay, loosen up. You gotta shake that. For three days, the Giles family drilled, dug, and struggled to save their dog. Finally, after 60 hours, Rebel was pulled out of the hole and into the arms of Stephanie Giles, who loves it. We got you, buddy. Then at 2 a.m. last night, a drill hole filled up with water. The special electronic collar Rebel wore stopped moving. All of the rescuers thought the dog had drowned. Owner Stephen Giles brought a few of the scores of trophies Rebel has won to the scene. We were going to actually bury him in the hole with him. Kind of a memorial to him, I guess. But Stephanie Giles wouldn't let them quit. Oh, my dad was thinking he was drowned, going to bury it up last night. I just kept telling him, what if it was me down there? Because a big drill rig was already on site, rescuers drilled one last hole, though they were sure the dog was dead. But there was Rebel at the bottom of the hole, whining to get out. Though the rescuers and the dog could see each other, no one knew how to get Rebel up the hole. This 10-inch hole and a 12-inch dog. Finally, they got a rope around his neck, used a collar stick, and just pulled him up through the hole by force. Rebel was muddy, tired and hungry, but also happy and healthy. Stephanie Giles hugged him and felt good. Happy. Rod Decker, 2 News. Though Rebels won more than 100 trophies as a raccoon hunting dog, Steve Giles says he's getting old now, and after this scare, well, he might not let him hunt raccoons anymore. Rebel needs a good rest. Rebel go, needs rough. retirement, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.